what's going on guys today we're gonna be taking a look at my custom Bane figure now I assembled this Bane by using the top half of the DC superheroes Bane and of course his uh, legs are notoriously short and they have uh, they're like bent at an angle so a lot of people were like pretty mad because the top part was huge and the legs were small and you couldn't really articulate his legs and I saw a video of a guy and he used the Despero legs but I ended up using the uh, Atom Smasher legs because I had two Adams uh, I had the the two legs uh, as a custom fodder so I went ahead and used them for this figure now I do have some pictures where I was working on the legs uh, the only bad part was that the Despero legs you could change them I think at the knee and they just went right in but the ones I used the Adam Smasher legs uh, it took a little bit more work because the hinge didn't fit so then I had to like modify it to fit in but the reason I did that was so that I wouldn't use the lose the ankle rockers that he comes with um, but I did retain all the articulation his legs move um, swivel even the boot the boot swivel I kept so that was pretty cool um, I just like these legs they're, they're pretty cool and they fit his body a little bit better I also touched up the red here um, I don't know if you could see it but I did a uh, paint a red a red uh, button and a green button on his gauntlet for his venom uh, I just added little accents like that, a little bit of silver. Um, I did end up uh, painting his mask white because it was silver on the figure. So I ended up painting it white. And uh, besides that, I mean, he's all good. The only other thing I did was I, I painted his veins from the Venom. But I didn't want to go too heavy, so I just did it like pretty light. But uh, that's pretty much all I did. Just touch ups and of course the, the pants. But let's uh, let's do some size comparison. All right, so here he is next to the Nightfall Batman. So he's like more to scale, he's way taller. And then here's my Build-A-Figure from Wave 16, but he's a slight bit taller than him, but I still like this guy uh, a little bit more. This guy's cool though, I mean you can't, can't go wrong. Um, but I'll be doing a review of him when I get to Wave 16, which might be like in 10 years. But uh... That's it, I mean. Came out pretty nice. I'm going to be happy to display him. Um, besides that, the only other difference was that this Bane came with his uh, emblems on the bottom of his boots. So, that was pretty cool. And, of course, this guy didn't come with no emblem. Anyways guys, that was just a quick vid to show off my custom Bane. I mean, I think he's pretty cool. Um, I, I'm going to start working on some other customs. It just, uh, I got to make time for it. Uh, this guy wasn't that much work. I mean, besides the leg swap and uh, the repaint, um, you know, it didn't take that long. But I'm going to try and get into some harder customs and uh, I'll be showing out. You know, at first I did just head swaps and now I'm getting more into painting. 
So we'll see what I uh, come up with. But anyways, thanks for checking it out. See you next time.